Hi everyone. Welcome to the online version of the KINE 3520 Applied Exercise Physiology course here at the University of Toledo. I am your course director for the semester, Dr. Tom McLaughlin. You'll usually see me signing on and off emails or course announcements as Dr. M. Now, I am from Long Island, New York. I tend to speak very quickly. I am going to try to slow down on these videos. I tend to get excited and want to get going. If at any point I am speaking too quickly, you can't understand, right about probably here on your, uh, that's my dog making noise, right? Right about here on the uh, YouTube page, you'll see a CC button, which is closed captioning. So you'll see, you click on that button and all the, uh, the actual words will be coming across the screen. All right, so at any point, please feel free to do that, but I will do my best to try to slow down. Anyway, you're all in the right uh, place to start. You're in the Start Here page, so good job. All A-plus there. After you get done uh, watching this lovely video, uh, please make sure to read through all of the Start Here information. Uh, it'll help kind of point your compass uh, for initial success in the course, and it'll provide you direction on where to kind of go next. Most notably, it'll point you towards the Welcome Forum, which is on the left side of the uh, of your Blackboard course homepage. You'll see uh, that uh, Welcome Forum tab contained in that folder. And in there, I just ask you to go in there, introduce yourself to me and to your fellow classmates, tell me a little bit about you. This way, can kind of open up a little bit of an interaction. All right, so please make sure to do that. Immediately after that, go towards uh, the meat and bones section of the course, which has a lot of boring information, but uh, also some valuable information about technical aspects of the course, uh, in particular, uh, the syllabus. It'll give you information on where to go, which will be a good place to, to go next. See, I'm starting to speak fast again. I'm getting excited. Um, go toward the, the syllabus tab, which is essentially the course contract, right? So, in there, you'll see all the schedule information, the requirements for the course, all of that information is contained in the syllabus. Uh, the first week of the class, uh, one of the requirements is an introduction quiz. Right? That introduction quiz is going to challenge you and your knowledge about things like the syllabus, right? the, uh, uh, the meat and potatoes section, uh, uh, the start here page information. All of that important information is in the introduction quiz. You'll need to score 100% on the quiz, and you can take it as many times as you want. There's no points associated with it. It's really there just to make sure you understand the requirements for the course and to make sure the technical aspects of the course are dealt with. So if you're having problems with the quiz and getting it to open, we can work through that information. We can work through those problems. Now you'll see that uh, within the syllabus and within the start here information, and I have it repeated several times in the course because it's important, because my degree is in physiology, not in IT or computer engineering. If you are experiencing problems with the course at all from a technological aspect, you can't get Blackboard to open, you can't see the content, you're having problems getting the quiz to open, contact Learning Ventures, not me. Not me. Um, I do not contain the, uh, the skills necessary to help remedy any technical problems. Learning Ventures is your contact, either through uh, phone or through email, and that information has been given to you in several locations in the course, the syllabus uh, and the, uh, the meat and potatoes sections in particular. One of the other aspects of the course, which is important right off the bat, is just to appreciate is there's a requirement for class participation. Make sure you read through the syllabus, make sure you understand the class participation component. All right? There are no specific due dates. I ask you to kind of get that on that early just to make sure we open up rapport and we have a nice exchange throughout the semester. All right? But make sure you understand where that's located. It's in the class discussions tab off to the left side of the course homepage and you'll see uh, that class participation uh, section contained therein. After that, all right, then it's 
getting into the fun, right? So please, uh, after you get through the initial introduction material, start getting into the course content, which is in the modules. You'll see the modules start to open up uh, throughout the semester. You will not see all of them open up immediately. You'll see modules number one and two open, which is kind of background, introduction material, and uh, uh, homeostasis, as well as exercise epidemiology. And as the course schedule starts to kind of unfold, those modules will pop up uh, and become available throughout the semester. All right? Think I kind of got it all? All right? Um, I'll be popping in and checking in with you uh, on a frequent basis, but if there's any questions, please uh, write me an email uh, or go to the class discussions section and fire off a question in the, the question and answer uh, forum of the course. All right? So enjoy. Have a great start to the semester, and I will be checking in soon. Thanks. Bye.